Dear students, one day some children were going to a zoo. They had some mangoes with themselves. Let's see how many mangoes did they have. One student came with two mangoes. The other one also came with two mangoes. Now there are four mangoes. The third one also had two mangoes. Now there are six mangoes. In the fourth bowl, a student came with two mangoes. Now there are eight mangoes in these four bowls. Now see, two is here for how many times? One, two, three, four. So we can say students, four times two, they went by cars. They had three cards. One, two, three. Each car has four wheels. One, two, three, four. Now see students. Four and four, eight. And eight and four is equal to twelve wheels. Now see students how many times there is four. One, two, three. So we can say 3 times 4. This animal has 4 legs. Second one is also having 4 legs. 4 and 4 is equal to 8. Third animal is also having 4 legs. 8 plus 4 is equal to 12. The fourth animal also has 4 legs. 12 plus 4 is equal to 16. Now see students, how many times 4 is there? 1, 2, 3, 4. So we can say 4 times 4. On the way back to their home, they felt hunger. They had some apples. They distributed those one among themselves. Now see how many apples were there. In the first ball, there were five apples. In the another one, there are also five apples. Now five plus five is equal to ten apples. In the third ball, there are also five apples. Now ten plus five is fifteen apples. In the fourth one, there are also five apples. Now there are 20 apples. In the fifth one, there are also 5 apples. Now 20 plus 5 is equal to 25 apples. And in the last one, there are also 5. Now 25 plus 5 is equal to 30 apples. Now see students, how many times 5 is there? Count with me. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we can say 6 times 5. Students, to count all the mangoes, we added 2, 4, 4 times. So there were 8 mangoes in all. By adding 2, 4, 4 times, we got 8. 4 times 2. 4 times 2 means 4 multiplied by 2. Here we can use the sign of multiplication on the place of times. As we use the sign of addition to add the two numbers. Similarly, we use the sign of multiplication to multiply two digits. So 4 multiplied by 2 will be equal to 8. To count the wheels of the cards, we added 4, 4, 3 times and we got 12 wheels in all. So students, 3 times 4 means 3 multiplied by 4. Here we can use the sign of multiply on the place of times. 3 multiplied by 4 is equal to 12. Students, to count the legs of all the animals, we added 4 times 4. So, we got 16 legs in all. 
फोर टाइम्स फोर मीन्स फोर मल्टीप्लाई बाय फोर हेयर वी कैन यूज द साइन ऑफ मल्टीप्लीकेशन एट द प्लेस ऑफ टाइम्स सो फोर मल्टीप्लाइड बाय फोर इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटीन Dear students, to count all the apples, we added five, four, six times, and then we got thirty. So see here, six times five means six multiplied five. Here we can use the sign of multiplication at the place of times, and so we can say six multiplied by five will be equal to. Thirty six into five is equal to thirty. Dear students, we have learned how to make groups and then change it into times and then into multiply. Now we will learn how to multiply will change into times and then into groups. Four multiplied by two is equal to eight. It means we have to add two four. Four times and it will be eight. Four times two. Dear students, see here. Three multiplied by four is equal to twelve. It means three times four. Three times four means four will be added four three times and it will be twelve. Four multiplied by four is equal to sixteen. It means we have to add the four groups of four, and it will be sixteen. Six multiplied by five is equal to thirty. It means we have to add five four six times, and it will be thirty. Six times five.